Hey there, this is Kirk TV and today we are talking about 5 ways to feel better. And so, with that said, let's get right into it. Number 5. Write a song. Did you know making music gives us permission to feel our feelings and process our emotions? The hard emotional labor that goes into songwriting pays off for musicians in big ways. It helps us to be more attentive in our relationships and more empathetic in the way we view the world. You can think of it as sort of an emotional awareness training benefit that you can't get working at a conventional job. Writing music is one of the most human and emotionally revealing things a person can do. This is because songs contain human stories not only by way of lyrics but also through the arrangement of sounds. Songwriting can help reveal the humanity in yourself. Familiarity with humanity allows you to be more compassionate to others and yourself, and that's an asset that can benefit you and the people closest to you for the rest of your life. Even if you are not much for songwriting, try whistling something new that comes to your head. You will be happier you did. Number Number 4. Get out somewhere, go do something. Traveling rewires your brain, it improves relationships, it builds connections, and having valuable experiences in life has more self-benefits as you get older. Spending money on a new experience could be more important and are beneficial than buying something new because the experience stays with you forever and you can always take it with you wherever you go. As people, when we are reminded of a good experience we have had before, we instantly become much happier. According to neuroscientists, when we travel, we rewire our brains. This is because new experiences are the key to building new neural pathways in the brain. By rewiring your brain, you become more creative and accepting of new ideas. This is why getting out and traveling or just doing something outside can bring you happiness. Number three, read comics and comic books. Comics can provide a form of escapism for individuals struggling with mental health issues. When reading a comic, a person can temporarily escape from the challenges and stressors of their daily life and enter a fictional world where they can relax and unwind. The act of reading can also be therapeutic in and of itself. It helps to calm the mind and reduce feelings of anxiety or depression. In addition, the themes and characters often found in comics can provide a sense of comfort and familiarity, helping a reader to feel connected and understood. Overall, comics can be a useful tool for promoting mental health and well-being through their ability to provide a sense of escape and relaxation. Reading comics also increases and improves cognitive stimulation, social support, emotional expression, inspiration and motivation, relaxation, coping with stress, enhancing creativity, improving sleep patterns, and helps with loneliness. If you want to feel happy, then dive into a comic book. Number two, take a nap. Naps can deliver a number of benefits. Brief naps can be restorative and reduce fatigue during the day. After a night of insufficient sleep, a nap may counteract daytime drowsiness. Naps can be particularly beneficial for shift workers who struggle to get enough sleep and have to be alert at irregular times. A nap can improve cognitive functions such as memory, logical reasoning, and the ability to complete complex tasks. Some studies have found that physical performance can also improve after napping. Napping may provide other health benefits. One observational study found that napping one or two times a week was associated with a lower risk of cardiovascular problems such as heart attack, stroke, or heart disease. Napping may also reduce the impacts of insufficient sleep. For example, a small trial found evidence that naps relieved stress and supported the immune system in people whose sleep was limited the night before. Additionally, naps may contribute to the well-being of specific groups of people. For instance, a study of people diagnosed with intracranial aneurysms found that regularly napping was associated with a lowered risk of a rupture of the aneurysm. So hey, if you want to cheer up a bit and feel happier, go lay down and take a nap. Number 1. Play with a pet. Most pet owners are clear about the immediate joys that come with sharing their lives with companion animals. However, many of us remain unaware of the physical and mental health benefits that can also accompany the pleasure of snuggling up to a furry friend. It's only recently that studies have begun to scientifically explore the benefits of the human-animal bond. Pets have evolved to become acutely attuned to humans and our behavior and emotions. Dogs, for example, are able to understand many of the words we use, but they're even better at interpreting our tone of voice, body language, and gestures. And like any good human friend, a loyal dog will look into your eyes to gauge your emotional state and try to understand what you're thinking and feeling. Pets, especially dogs and cats, can reduce stress, anxiety, and depression, ease loneliness, encourage exercise and playfulness, and even improve your cardiovascular health. 
Caring for an animal can help children grow up more secure and active. Pets also provide valuable companionship for older adults. Perhaps most importantly, though, a pet can add real joy and unconditional love to your life. Could it be true that your next pet is just waiting to make you smile right now? So get out there and put a smile on that wonderful face of yours. And there you go, that is 5 ways to feel better. Thanks for watching Kurt TV and I'll see you in the next video.